the shoulder to cry on. Everyone needs a helping hand. Everyone needs someone to rely on. Yes, everyone needs a friend. So let's come together, celebrate each other, stand united. Good morning, y'all. Just took a shower after having my time with Jesus and my coffee. And like I said, just got a shower, so I gotta go dry my hair and do all the things. But we are actually going to go drive around today before we pick up the groceries and go to Cheese and More store down in the next county over because I need to get some stuff and I just want to see what else they have. And then we might even go look at some scenery because it is my absolute favorite time of year. But from what I can see out here, a lot of our leaves have completely fallen off due to rain and wind. But that happens this time of year, but maybe I can still get some pretty collars. We're going to go ahead and fix something quick for breakfast and get our day going. All right, so I got our bread here, got some Gouda, some mayo, some just yellow American, and we got some eggs right here. I'm going to go ahead and make us some egg sandwiches, and I'm just going to use salt and pepper on them per my husband's request. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and get these sandwiches made, and I'll bring you back and show you what they look like. But I need to get out my hot sauce, because that's what I like on mine instead of mayo. I love mayo, don't get me wrong, but I want hot sauce on mine. So, we are ready to head out. It is gorgeous outside. Put my creamer up from this morning. It's mid-70s. Beautiful sunshine, everything. It's gorgeous. I love it. If it could just stay this temperature and weather all year round, yes, please. Sign me up. <laughs> bring you out here because we have one little flower that's hanging on for dear life we all need to be like this little pansy with our faith in jesus because i mean it's hanging on for everything it's done made it through the frost we've had two frost and it's still here and i'm just like amazed because i had two hanging baskets right here and they have already you know they're done for the year but this little purple pansy of all colors um it's, it's, it's growing through rocks and weeds. I mean, if that's not telling you something, I don't know what it is. We need to have a good, strong faith in, in Jesus, just like this little flower is holding on for dear life. Look at this little purdy thing right here. Let me move my hand. <laughs> is that not the sweetest thing ever? I mean, it's got a little leaf. Something's ate it, probably a bunny or something, but... I mean, it, it's hanging on in there. I just, I love it. The sun is awesome. <laughs> it is so bright. <sighs> we'll definitely need my sunglasses today. I can tell you that. Make my eyes water a little bit, but we're gonna go ahead and um, get ready to go. And hopefully we can see some pretty colors. Say hi. <laughs> Not 
See what we can find and he done spotted a bakery across the road so we'll probably go in there too So we went in there, but it was packed plum full of people, but we did get a sandwich and now we're gonna have a little bitty of a picnic. So we got a roast beef with herb mayo, some tater salad, and a vanilla cream soda. Probably breaking everybody out. Probably. But, huh? Got me. <laughs> but we picked up some frittles. They're freeze dried Skittles, and I love the wild berry ones, so that's what is right here. It's good. We are heading to Walmart now to pick up our groceries and then to the house. This is too cool. You can write like your menu board or your grocery list and the paper comes in here and you tear it off. That is so cool. $24.99. And they got this egg, ceramic. And then they've got this one. An egg holder, which is very cute. But my child eats so many eggs. Wouldn't be worth it. Oh, I love this. Those are cool. They're $12.99, and it's like the ones I have, but they're different colors. Salt and pepper. I like that. So we just finished the grocery haul. I still gotta put that stuff up. 
but I wanted to go ahead and show you everything that we got from our little adventure, our road trip today. I'm going to have to close these curtains because it's a little bit on the bright side right here. Okay, so we'll start with the bakery first, and I'll show you, and then we'll move to Tractor Supply, and then we'll go to the Cheese and More store. I was so excited we got to go there today because it's my favorite place ever, but man, it was packed. So, here right, we go. So, we got two loaves of sourdough bread. I love sourdough bread. I need to go ahead and make my starter again because I miss it. I need to make my own. <laughs> so, maybe I'll go ahead and start a starter. Start a starter? Yeah, start a starter tomorrow. And then, do not panic. This is the incorrect price. It was not that much. It was only, I think three or three three four dollars i think um it's a lemon pie so hopefully i love anything lemon so <laughs> i mean it's basic ingredients so you can't get much better than that um that's the name of the bakery that we got it from the dough ball bakery i think that's cute so that's everything that we got from there and then as far as tractor supply goes i picked up my doggos some treats I hear, I hear footsteps. Which one's coming around first? Mason's coming around first. Did you hear mama say that? <laughs> but I got, ooh, kick the stool. I got two of the mini, the peanut ear. It's a taste of peanut butter, apples, carrots, and molasses. They absolutely love these. So I went ahead and got them two bags and that'll last a good amount of time. And then I think I showed these in the vlog as well in the video i can't remember but i think i did but i got these because i like the white and black ones better because i have them already but they're in the yellow and the green so you can see they are the same ones it's just different colors and i think that's kind of cool but it says different names up there. Did y'all see that? It is different. How about that? Well, I declare. Anywho, these are really good salt and pepper shakers. But I got the salt and pepper shakers. And they have the S and the P on them. As where these are just solid. And then I got this little trivet right here. Because my trivet that I got from Tractor Supply I've had it for about two or three years. It's not broke. It's just that the cork that's on the back of it's fallen off. And I like this better because it just has the little pads on it. So I'm probably going to pull the rest of the cork off. And just put the little pads on it. And then I'll have two of them. But I thought this one was so pretty. It's got that bluish gray tint and the teal green colors. I love it. So pretty. So I got that at Tractor Supply. And then the Cheese and More store is right here. Now I got these freeze-dried frittles. <laughs> They're just the wild berry frittles. They're the Skittles, the freeze-dried Skittles. They are so good. I picked up some chopped onions. Yummy. I love getting spices and seasonings down there. Then I picked up some sesame seeds as well. My husband um, found this soap down there, tan made soap with um, fresh cow's milk. It was $5 for this bar, but it's green tea and you can see everything that is in it. Y'all, this smells so good and I'm sure it's going to do wonders for your skin. So we got a bar to try. I picked up another big bag of the chives from down there because you cannot beat that price for this. I mean, it's the size of my hand. So it is only $5.44 for that. And chives are expensive for some reason, but I love them. I like putting them in my um, mater soup and baked taters or anything like that. And then I picked up some of my Madagascar vanilla. It, it's pricey, but it's so good. So good. And then I got some imitation uncolored vanilla extract. Um, this is a good brand. And sometimes, I've, you know, I've been curious about the, the uncolored vanilla. So we're going to give that a try and see what it's like. We picked up some garlic ring bologna. I think this is more of like the cracker bologna. I think that's what it's called in the stores, but we got the garlic ring one and then we just got original. So we got garlic bologna and original bologna. 
And then I picked up this roasted pepper cream cheese. I figured this would be amazing on some bagels or anything like that. So we got a thing of it. I got some pumpkin cream cheese for the same reason. I mean, this is what, almost three quarters of a pound. Um, so I got those for bagels or toast or anything, crackers, it don't matter. I think it'd be good on all of it. <laughs> and then I picked up some cheesy potato and bacon soup starter. Cheesy potato with bacon flavor. And then it tells you how to make it and everything. So I'm anxious to try that one evening. And then this is what I use when I do my little um, oven baked potatoes. I do this with a beefy onion soup mix and oh my goodness, it's so good. But you can do it with just the beefy onion soup mix. It's, you know, not an issue. It's just as good. So, oh, they got close. I got two of those because I like having enough. And I picked up, I thought I had another soup mix. So I got a broccoli soup mix as well. It also, it's cream of broccoli, and it also tells you how much of this to use in water or milk, but I would definitely use milk. But that is everything that we got at the Cheese and More store. So now it's time for me to put all of this away and get it all straightened up, and that's probably going to be the end of the video, but I can't make any promises on that because I don't know what the rest of the day holds, but I better get busy putting this stuff away. told y'all wasn't done. <laughs> I want to introduce y'all the best tea ever. Y'all know I'm a tea fanatic, sweet tea, peach tea, raspberry tea, it don't matter. I love my sweet tea. So I was super excited when the Southern Sweet Tea Company reached out to me and wanted me to review their tea. And let me tell you something, they did not disappoint. I absolutely love this tea. I'll have all their information down below and I've tried them both. You can't go wrong with either one, but my favorite is the Southern Sweet Tea Company's Peach Iced Tea, George Peach as they call it, but it is amazing. It is definitely a must try. So let me flip you around and I'll show you all of that. So they sent me both of these. You get 10 family size tea bags. They make one gallon. One tea bag makes one gallon, as you see right there. This is their original, just their plain old caffeinated iced tea. So good, y'all. And I mean, how cute are the bags? And then they also sent me their Georgia peach tea. Same deal. It's a gallon size tea bag. And y'all cannot, oh, this, this stuff, this tea is so good. Run, run to the website and go get yours today. Because let me tell you something, they are amazing. I will be getting my tea from here on out through them. That's how much I love this product. So I don't recommend products I don't like or I don't speak highly of companies that I don't like. Um, I love these. These, these, these teas, y'all, y'all missing out if y'all have not tried them yet. So if you haven't, definitely go try them out. Like I said, I'll have everything linked down below so y'all can go and enjoy y'all some Southern Sweet Tea Company tea. You won't be disappointed. Trust me on this.